Hey, I'll come look at this. Two teachers and two aides have been suspended so far still. They don't feel comfortable sending their kids back to school. What happened with the sticker? The sticker um, makes me fall asleep. This is four-year-old Lane Luviano. She's the one that broke this case open in September when she snuck one of her sleepy stickers out of the classroom. She kind of pulled up her little shorts and said, Mom, look, this is my sleeping sticker. And I was like, the what? When Lane's mom, Lisa, saw the sticker, she thought it was strange and asked her daughter about it. And the teacher gives it to you where she put it? On my arm. On your arm? Which part? Point to it. Right up there? Yeah. And what's it look like? Um, sleeping with a moon on it. Lane's dad says he's known something was wrong since school first started. Two o'clock in the morning, I'm hearing her. The room, some noise in the room, and I'm going over there. She's still up. And so she gives you the sticker. You put the sticker on, and it makes you tired? Yeah. Wow. And all the kids get them? Yeah. They never notified the parents. So Lisa took matters into her own hands. She reached out to the other parents in Lane's class, sent them pictures of the patch to see if their kids were getting the stickers too. I showed it to my four-year-old, um, and she said, yes, that's... That's the sleepy sticker. Melissa Guilford immediately went online to research the sticker. Sleep Z patch. Mm. Okay, so, and if you read the ingredients on them, it has a lot of, I mean, it's just things I've never even heard of. And they're giving them drugs to make them sleep, to keep them quiet. Najala Abdullah tells us she'd noticed changes in her son, who told her he'd been getting the stickers too. She says he'd been crying, stopped eating, and was bringing home lunches that he hadn't touched. The parents shared with us an email they received from Northgate Crossing Elementary's principal today. The email states two of the school staff members were put on leave after they allegedly administered sleeping supplements to students on September 24th. The email also states the Spring ISD Police Department is... I've always told people that you should listen to your children. They know things, they, 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 they see things so they can say things, you know, and they say it in the, in the plainest way, more than, more than an adult will be able to say it, and they say it in such a way you'll be able to understand. You see... Children can sense things too. So just as this girl actually sensed this and took it outside for an adult to actually see it, and before you know it, she blew, she blew, she blew the case wide open for everyone to see. And before you know it, every parent was alerted, and boom, the whole the whole, the whole rabbit hole exploded, all from a little girl's um, 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 testimony. And when the parents actually did their research, they, they started figuring out that maybe this is the reason why their children are, have actually been acting out, acting out of, you know, act of normal, you know. It is, it is crazy what we see going on, guys. It is, it is purely crazy. If these teachers don't want to do the job anymore, they should just call it quit and say, okay, I'm not doing it anymore. I'm tired. Then somebody else will take over. Than doing this, you're you're, you're tarnishing the, your 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 image, and you're you're not doing justice to these children. To be honest, you are not doing justice to to these children, and even God Almighty in heaven will hold you responsible. That's the truth. That's the truth, guys. We need to we need to call this out. Please share this video, guys. Share it so that you can actually get to more parents.